Kiss score. There's Kisko working hard underneath. Block partially. Kisko tries again. Yes. For yes. perseverance on the part of uh, De La Salle. UP asking for a traveling against Kisko. Just a one point lead here for UP. Both fan bases are on their feet here at the arena in San Juan. Oh, oh, Lopez, what a oh, great right away yes. from Kisko. Great play there. He just fooled the defense of Kishko, that hesitation play, giving him another basket. What what shots made Red by Mark Lopez seconds. in the fourth? It's Season guarding Webb, and uh, there is going to be a foul three of the ball. Three, three seconds seconds violation. violation on Lasalle. Wow. What do you call for Arvin It's Barua called for the three second violation. Take a look at the nifty move by Mark Lopez. This is clearly a mismatch. And yep. I, under, I don't understand how the, uh, the defense of La Salle allowed that. That's our power rate hyper play of the game. Well, Lopez... Bring the power up, plus sports is what you make it. Lopez has been doing that today, but there was no weak side help coming for, for, for La Salle. That's why Lopez has been easy access for them here in the fourth against La Salle. Now La Salle makes an adjustment. It's Bagat Singh guarding Lopez. Season has been begging for the leather against uh, Payson Andrada on the pick and roll. Lopez oh, right. gets the ball to him. Lopez. Season is on a long block by Andrada. What a great play by the rookie center of La Salle. Under a minute left, three point advantage for UP 1877. Everybody's on the edge of their seats here at the arena. I'm pretty sure you at home are too. But that scene from the outside misses, gets the ball back. Fresh 24 for De La Salle. Are they looking for a three? Well, they're looking for Barua. Mangahas to Bagatsing. Ten seconds. Ten seconds on the shot clock for La Salle. Bagatsing attacks. There is a foul on UP. Well, 19 seconds. What are the oh, situations possible here? Well, Bagatsing takes two free throws. He makes both. It's going to be a one-point ball game. And uh, UP will have possession in the last 19 seconds. And a big block by Andrada, giving La Salle an opportunity here in the fourth quarter. 19 seconds, two free throws. They're able to catch this one, but Bagatin just making it a two-point ball game with the first free throw made. And that is his first trip to the free throw line. He is an 87.5% free throw shooter. Same, actually identical numbers for Joshua, with Joshua Webb for free throw shooter. Oh, but he missed. And Lopez got the ball knocked away from him. It stays with UP, according to the officials, to the light so of the UP crowd. So two seconds chop off, two point advantage here for UP. And Lasalle with a foul to give here. Coach Abu Kafe putting the ball the better shooters. Big Diaz is replacing Baggy Season. And better ball handlers as well. Yes. Reyes is quickly fouled by Tolentino, who started at the one uh, spot for Lasal, but never really saw action after the first few minutes. Now, which one to foul for Lasal? Reyes obviously trying to get the ball and mix the ass. That's going to be the foul. It's the ass has actually missed two free throws earlier, so he could have been potentially oh, yes. a good person to foul. I should have got Ayram Bagatsin on the second, missing, and Lopez chasing it down. Well, he has really played big here in the absence of Alvin Padilla in the fourth quarter because of that sprained ankle. First three quarters, Mark Lopez was one of five in the quarter. Fourth quarter, six points, three of three. No one hit shots when they needed the basket to get some breathing room. Mark Lopez provided it. Pressure pack free throws from Mike Reyes, who has 24 points. That's a career high, 10 out of 16 shooting, and also career high six assists. Uh, two free throws made here by Mike will be in a two percent lead. It's now a three point ball game in favor of UP. 6156. And ever since it's been six straight wins by LaSalle over UP. 
5.7 seconds remaining. Anything is still possible. Just a three-point lead for UP. And Gingrich is quickly fouled oh, by Valentino. Now, Gingrich, he has to make at least one here to make it a two-possession game. Both, if, if he misses both free throws, there's still a little window for the side. This is his first trip to the free throw line this season, Professor. Gingrich will be tested today. Well, earlier, I think he was given a free throw play uh, when he was fouled by, uh, uh, by Jovic Mendoza. He didn't convert. And he still could not convert, so still a window, but crucial here for LaSalle. They have to get the rebound. What UP has to do is to crowd LaSalle. Maybe, just maybe, UP can foul should LaSalle should LaSalle get possession of the ball. They could offer a foul and just to avert a three-point play. But, you know, let, let's see what they're going to play the card. Depends on Gingrich. He missed both. Oh, what an amazing possession. play by and Mikey Reyes bouncing it off the foot of Tolentino. Mikey Reyes has done it all this afternoon. Wow. I told you it's crucial that LaSalle takes care of the leather after the missed free throw. Mikey Reyes stealing this game from his former alma mater. What a career game for Mikey. Martin Reyes is fouled by Mangahas, but at this point it seems like it is good already. Well, he has to make, look at this fish shot by uh, Gingrich. From the outside, look at Mikey Reyes. He wasn't sealed by anybody. He was able to get that ball. Good observation there, Eric. And he's able to make that play. We all know he's a pretty steady free throw shooter, Martin Reyes. That is point number three yes, for uh, Martin Reyes in very, this game. Very important. That will do it. That will do it. That will do it. Well, 1.6 seconds, 5 point lead, Nasal. Even if they make a 3 point shot, it will still be a 3 point advantage for UP. So UP. The call of Coach Abue Castro after he showed his displeasure during the game by coming into the court. And uh, having himself be called a technical foul. They trailed USD by as much as 31, but today they had control of the game and they never let go. Yep, and uh, they really showed a lot of character. LaSalle was there threatening every opportunity, but their defense holding down LaSalle to the last play, to the last play of Mikey Reyes. You know, able